Spirit Airlines says it suspended an employee who works at DFW Airport, and police are now investigating after an argument with a traveler got out of control. Airport police were not on the scene while that fight was happening. They took a report based on the accounts of the people involved, plus witnesses who recorded the video. This apparently started over a problem with seating on a flight. Fox Sports' Peyton Yeager joins us now with more. Peyton. Heather, and no one was taken into custody. Both parties involved were interviewed and released at the scene yesterday. So far, no one has been officially charged. DFW Airport Police say the investigation is ongoing. Don't put her, she can't put her hands on me. It's a video that's now been viewed by millions. A violent incident between a now suspended Spirit Airlines supervisor and a traveler. Video shows them both on the ground shortly after she yelled a series of homophobic slurs at him shoved him and hit him inside DFW International Airport on Thursday. I'm at the Panda Express and we just hear yelling and uh, I drop my food, I run over and my instinct is just to pull out the camera and start recording. Professional photographer Thomas Shannon is the person behind the camera who is unsure at this point what sparked the argument. How do we get here? Why do people think this is okay? According to a DFW police incident report released Friday, the female passenger from Fort Worth became angry during the boarding process. The Spirit employee told airport police the woman got off the plane complaining there wasn't a seat for her. He says he asked the woman to get in line with the gate agent, but witnesses say the woman cut in front of others and became uncooperative. It escalated further when police say the supervisor tried to take her boarding pass. You're in my personal space. Another passenger tried to separate the two. The woman is seen reaching around a few times, hitting the employee in the face. That's when he rushed her. They both fell to the ground. Police say she fell while attempting to run after hitting him, tripping over a chair. Once they got up, the employee puts his hands on the woman. She, you know, was verbally assaulting him, physically assaulting him, and uh, he just snaps. The woman told police she didn't do anything, and the employee pushed her for no reason before the cameras rolled. Police spoke with both of them after the incident. There was no security present. The officer who filled out the report suggested the woman's injuries came from the moment she fell over the chair. In the initial report, police determined the traveler was the aggressor and may have committed assault. Out of the 10 years that I've been traveling uh, professionally, I've never seen that. We reached out to both parties involved. The employee did not answer. The woman answered. She tells me that she's hired an attorney and maintains that the Spirit Airlines employee was the aggressor, but it was not captured on video. Spirit Airlines released a statement and says it's cooperating with local law enforcement and does not tolerate violence of any kind.